Hey everyone, it's Jonathan from Ben Morrell's product development team and today I'm going to tell you why this bypass valve is a must-have upgrade for your ZF 8-speed equipped BMW. Alright, to, to start with, what we're going to do is going to take a look at the stock thermostat housings and kind of get an idea of how they function so then we can show why our thermostat bypass is an improvement to the system. Um, so looking here, we have the stock thermostat housing and essentially this will sit inside of your transmission and you have your cooler lines that attach here and this goes on the transmission itself and the stock thermostat is the valve that controls where fluid runs through the system. Um, so if we're looking at the thermostat we can see that this is the stock thermostat in the closed um, position and what that does is it allows fluid to flow through the rear side of the thermostat and that essentially bypasses all your cooling system on this side and just runs the fluid through this half of the thermostat. Then as things get moving, get grooving, get up to temperature, it will then open up and allow fluid to flow out of here and then block off this end of the thermostat. And that will then prevent flow going this way and then send it through your cooler around and back. Um, this is great for a street car, you know, driving in the winter needs to come up to temperature, not putting a ton of heat into the system. But as these cars are driven harder, that's when you start to see more heat, uh, more heat soak, and you really need that increase in cooling. So here we have the GT4 Motorsport thermostat. It uses the same housing as the ones that come equipped with the street cars, um, with the only difference being the thermostat itself is forced open um, as delivered. And what this does is without any temperature in the system, you already have the bypass side of the valve um, open and that will then block off this section of the thermostat and run everything through your cooler and all that just off the get-go. Okay, so with all of that being said, now let's see why the Bimmer World bypass valve is the best solution for you. Uh, there's three main points here that we're worried about. It's materials, flow rates, and the fact that this is reversible. Um, I guess the first one that I mentioned was materials. The BMW piece that we have, even just filming B-roll, we've dropped it and chipped the corner. So this just, it's just a, a brittle plastic. And ours being billet aluminum, billet doesn't break. Um, point two is reversibility. So if you were to be dual purposing your car, you know, take it to the track for one weekend and then daily driving it you know, the next weekend, um, you can just remove your stock thermostat put this one in for the track and then take this one back out, put the stock thermostat back in and you still retain all the cooling potential that you need for the street and the, the cooling threshold um, on the track. Materials, reversible, flow rates. Thermostat, regardless of if it's open or not, still offers uh, flow restrictions. So that's the third point for ours is there is no thermostat inside, it's wide open, you get maximum flow at maximum efficiency all the time. Our recommendation when running the bypass valve is just like your engine oil temperature, you want to make sure that your transmission comes up to temp as well before you really start to beat on the car. BMW's recommendation for transmission temperature is 20 degrees Celsius or 68 Fahrenheit. We agree with that. Um, just make sure that you know, if it's a cold day, let your car idle for a little bit, come up to temp, and then as you're driving it, also let temperatures climb and just everything normalize before you really start to beat on the car. So there you have it. That is the new Bimmer World ZF8 Speed thermostat bypass valve. If you have any questions, comment below, give us a call. This is available at bimmerworld.com. Should be an awesome race weekend. We are ready to kill it this year. It's good. It's good. It's going to be a wild ride.